So, Mother, what gave you the idea to start reading to the residents at the nursing home when you were a little girl? Well, um, I loved hearing the Bible read, and uh, no matter uh, how old or how young the person was, it was extremely important to me to hear somebody uh, read the Bible because it was so exceptional. I mean, there was just, there is just one Bible, that's all. And uh, because there's only one Bible, why uh, that gives it something so special that uh, it's different from every other book. And uh, it was very, uh, for me, it was very special. Did someone ask you to go to the nursing home and start reading? No, nobody ever asked me to do anything like that. You just did it on your own? I just did it because I really wanted to do it. How did the how did the residents at the nursing home react? Well, the residents were uh, strange. They uh, some of them liked it and some of them didn't like it. The when you were older and you were a nurse, you worked in nursing homes again. Yes. And you used to talk to your patients about Jesus, didn't you? Yes, of course. And were you able to lead some of your patients to salvation? Well, some of them. Not everybody, but sometimes I was fortunate. So now that you are a visitor, a, a passing resident, a temporary resident here at a nursing home, are you able to tell some of the people here about Jesus? Yes, yes I am. It's, uh, it's very easy for me to talk to people about the Lord. Why is it so easy? I guess it's because I've always done it. Some people have a hard time telling people about Jesus. Well, I think it's, for me, it's because I've always, uh, I always felt like I knew Jesus. And uh, that uh, the more I talked to him, the better I knew him. Some people have a hard time talking to him. Um, they don't know how to talk to him. Well, I think you're right there. And uh, well, I think it is very hard for, for many, many people to, uh, to know the Lord. But um, sometimes we can help them to know him better. How? Just by talking to them. If there's two people and you talk to one of them about the other, the other one is going to have a, a, a greater uh, virtue or going to know more about uh, uh, the Lord than the person that nobody talked to. I mean, that's just logic. So what we have to, to do is learn ourselves not to be afraid to talk about Jesus, but to be able to tell the truth about Jesus. What is the truth about Jesus? Well, the truth about Jesus actually is a salvation. The main, main, main thing about, uh, about Jesus is the salvation. He died, he gave his life that we might be saved. That's the main thing that he came for. He came to live and die that we might have everlasting life. Why would he do that? 
there's only one answer, and that is because he, he cares. He cares. He loved us so much that he wanted us to be saved. And how many years have you been telling people about Jesus? All of my life, almost. I'd say, um, I'd say probably, possibly 50 years. I think more than that. Maybe, I don't know for sure. Weren't you about nine years old when you started going to the nursing home? I was very young, yes. And telling the kids in the neighborhood to come to Sunday school? Very young, yes. Who first told you about Jesus? I, I, don't, I don't really know. I don't remember. Your parents didn't take you to church, did they? No. It, well, yes and no. Sometimes yes and, and more times no. Mostly you went by yourself? Yeah, most I went on my own. Well, I've enjoyed hearing you talk about the Lord. And I hope the Lord gives you many opportunities to share his love to the people here. As long so as you're here. And I hope other people will be encouraged to talk about the Lord after hearing you share. Because what you said makes a lot of sense. If you talk about someone to someone else, they get to know each other. The, the one person will get to know the other one the more we talk about. The more we talk about the Lord, other people get to know Him and will feel more comfortable with Him. But how do we get to know the Lord better? The only way we can get to know the Lord is to talk to Him. To That's talk to all. Him. We have to talk to Him personally. And read the Word. And, of course, read the Word. Well, let's read the Word together. Is there a Bible verse you would want to share with everyone? I, I think... Um, I just think in any psalm would be good. All right. Well, we're going to do that now. Thank you, Mother. Goodbye. Bye.